All right, so hello and welcome to another Android Studio tutorial where in this video I'll be showing you how to create this snack bar and it's gonna be including an action which will show a toast message. Uh, you can replace it with whatever action you desire. And uh, the first thing we want to do is go to our Gradle file and add this dependency for the Google material design. And we're gonna click on sync now and then we are gonna go straight to our activity main XML and we are gonna change the default text view to a button. And we're gonna change the text to show snack bar and we're gonna give it an ID of button snack bar and then we can go to our main activity immediately and create a function so we're going to write create snack bar and we are going to actually give content to this create snack bar function right below by typing private function create snack bar and inside here we will add a on click listener for our button underscore snack bar and inside there we will write snack bar dot make and it's going to have the context of it which is going to refer to the snack bar button and we're gonna type button clicked and snack bar length long, or you can also put indefinite or short. Then we're gonna write dot set animation mode. This is a bonus. You write base transient bottom bar and we're gonna do dot animation mode fade for this one. Then we're gonna add a background tint to give it some more customization. It's gonna be color dot pass color. I'm gonna do hashtag 006400, which is a dark green. And we're gonna do dot set action, which is just gonna be called action. And we're gonna put a lambda expression, which will refer to it as the view and we're gonna add a toast which is just gonna have the context of this and it's gonna say snack bar button pressed. And the final thing to do is to type sh dot show. And that's all there is to creating a simple snack bar that you can customize in whatever you, way you want. And when you run the application, you'll see that when you click on the show snack bar button, it's gonna show you this snack bar. It's a bit ugly at the moment, but it works, it fades in which is quite different than it sliding in. I'll show you how to make it slide in, which it usually does that by default if you don't add this uh, part here. So I changed the length to indefinite, I changed the color to black, and finally I changed the animation mode to slide. And you don't have to include the animation mode, that is just an optional addition that you can change it to fade, but if you do include it, it will do the same thing as it originally did, which is just a sliding motion. And it does that by default, but uh, yeah, I hope this tutorial helped and uh, please leave a comment in the section below if there's anything else you'd like me to make and I'll see you in another video.